Welcome to the show. My guests today say their claws are coming out. Please meet Ricky. He says his heart is broken, and he's here to mend it. Ricky, what's going on? Hey, Jay, how you doing? Good. Um, I'm here today to get, the, get back the love of my life. I fell in love with him, and he broke my heart and dumped me. Oh, you're gay. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so you have a, I'm, I'm joking, you have a lover, and, uh, oh, but how long had you been going with him? Four months. Four months? Yeah. Okay, and now he's with someone else? Right. And this other guy stole him away? Right. But if, if, if your lover loved you, he wouldn't have let himself be stolen away. Right. <laughs> so why do you think it broke up? Well, like I said, um, the way I had met him is I'm a department manager for Walmart. And he came in one day to get a radio. Yeah. So we were talking, and one thing led to another. Um, we moved in together and everything. He um, told me that he loved me. Oh, because he was a shopper at Walmart. Right. Yeah. <laughs> And he was walking dial, down aisle seven. You saw him. You said, whoa, there is a Walmart shopper. <laughs> and, and so now you guys moved in together. Right. It's all going good. And yeah, now right. what happens? So I came home from work one day. Yeah. And I get in the house. And he's packing up his clothes. Oh. And he looks at me. And he tells me that he thinks that we're moving too fast. And we need to separate, take some time apart so he can clear his hair. So then I was devastated. He left. I didn't go to work for a week. So I'm sitting at the house crying. I um, was at the house one day, and one of my friends had called and wanted me to go with them to the club. So I told him, yeah, just so I could get my mind off of things. We arrived to the club, Jerry, and I'll go in. We're having a good time until I run into him, who is now kissing on another guy and they just like hugged up and locked up and everything. So I was like, I got devastated and angry. So I decided to go outside to try to cool off. When I went outside, I seen his car. Uh -oh. So I flattened all four of his tires on his car. Oh. <laughs> I cheated. <laughs> yeah. So oh. I flattened out four of his tires on his car. I keyed his car up. Oh. Then I left. <laughs> so a couple of days later, I decided to go back to the club. Well, I go back to the club, hoping that he was going to be there. I walk in. He's there. So I go up to try and confront him. And his boyfriend walks up in my face and was like, that's my man now. He's not yours no more. Right. So I reacted, and I kicked his ass. Oh. <laughs> Yeah. Let's bring out, well, okay, so who, now who was your lover? Nick. Nick. Mm -hmm. So Tyron is this, Tyrone or? Tyron is Tyron his new lover. Is, is this new guy in the picture. He's the guy you fought with at the club. Right. Well, he's here, so you can talk to him now. Here's Tyron. My question to you, I guess, is, were they already broken up when you started seeing Nick? Yes, they was. And Jerry, honestly, I can care less for him right now. 
It's about my, it's about my man. It's about the person that I love, you know, and what they got is over. Yeah. That's just it. So your real argument is not because he's saying, and is he telling the truth? He's saying that you guys were already broken up. Well, if you're already broken up, then if he goes with someone else, that's not your business. Why do you care? That's a lie. Oh, it's we a lie. We weren't broken up. You took him from me. How? What did I take? You was a sneaky bitch. What you got? What you, you got? Took from me. That I don't got. You took it from me. What you got? I got a whole lot that you ain't got. What you got that I don't got? I got a whole what lot. What you got that I don't get? I got a whole lot, bitch. What? what? I got a whole lot, bitch. What? I got a whole what? lot, bitch. What? I got a whole what? lot, bitch. What? 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 What you got that I don't get? I tell you what, let's bring out the other guy and find out what he has to say about this. Here's Nick. Why did you break up with him? Ricky, you know you rushed me into a lot of things. You want the whole world to know we was gay and we was together. I wasn't ready for that, Ricky. That's a lie. Because if you weren't ready for it, you wouldn't have came by Walmart like you was. You ain't come by there to get no more TVs. You ain't come by there to get no more radios. If you didn't love me like you say you don't, you wouldn't show up at my job like you do. Why did I show up at your job? You was calling me to your job. I wasn't calling you to my job. Was. I wasn't calling you to my job. You showed up to my job. But you care so much for me, but why would you slash my tires, kill my car? What sense does that make for you to care for me? That's passion love because I didn't want you with that bitch. I didn't want that bitch riding in the car that I pay for. The car you pay for? The car that I pay for. OK, Rick. He bought you a car? No, Jerry, no. Oh. <laughs> No, Jerry. If I didn't buy you a car, give me back the money I put in that engine. Give me back the money I put on the car for them tires. Do that. You cut my tires. Why well, would I give you the money that back? Right there. She ain't got nothing to do with this. I don't even know why you playing. You know I love you. And I do anything for you. And I want you to be with me. Why you want to do me like that? Oh. <laughs> Ricky. Why you want to do you me know, like that? You know, no. You're a good guy. No. I'm not giving up. I'm not letting you go. Not especially to that bitch back there. I'm not doing it. I'm not doing it. You can cancel it. You mine. No. Ricky, it ain't going to work out. You know that. You know that. Why? Because me and Aphrodite got something that. Y'all got what? We got a lot. Got what? Got a what lot. Got look at you now. Hand. You expect me to be with you and look how you acting what now. What you ain't got that we ain't got? We got a lot. Like she what? She took time. Took time to what? I took time. She ain't rushed me into nothing. I ain't rushed you. How'd I rush you? Rick, we was rushed from day one. I moved right in with you a week later. That was for, that was for your good, not mine. It wasn't for my it good. Too. You wanted it too just like it I did. It wasn't for my good. So why put it all on me? Why put it all on me? Why you put it all on me? Why? Why? For that bitch back there? What she got? What she got? Let me know what she got. <laughs> what you got? You got a lot. What you got? This one right here. Not for long. This that one, right one went home with me. This that one right went home with me. Trust that one. Bet you. That Three. one went home with me. That, bitch. that one went home with me. I bet you ain't. That one went home with me. Let me tell you something. We've been through too much to let a bitch come between us. You moved in to his house. We bought a house. I, I bought you a car. 
I did. So that piece of junk he, he claimed he bought for you, give him the keys. You got a car. You got you a I don't oh. care what he say, you stay with me. And it's Lord. As long as I'm on this earth, you won't have to ask for nothing. You won't have to want for nothing. I'd improve that to you for eight months. For eight months. He'll slash your tires because he can't have this. I want love. I don't want nothing you got. Nothing but your heart. He wants your looks. He wants your looks. We'll be back.